shoot at the skinny 45.
My name is Rambot. I'm here with Justin Compton. We're here at the NPC headquarters here in Pittsburgh. Uh, Masters Nationals just got done. We had a workout here at the NPC warehouse. We did chest and shoulders today with Justin. How do you feel? Uh, I'm more out right now. I'm really tired, but I think we got a good session in. Yeah, I mean, you were sweating your ass off because it was hot as hell out here. It's humid. Um, I know Jeremy and Tyler had a really good workout. Now, you know, tell me about nine weeks out. A lot of people are asking why you're, in, why you're not doing the Olympics. You want to tell everybody why you're not going to be Olympia? Um, I think I made a good decision on setting the show out this year. I want to you know, have a four-year off-season like I did last year, and I want to be able to come back in and make a big splash and a good impact next year. Hopefully, we're going to start with the Arnold in Columbus and hit several shows, you know, a couple more shows throughout the year, and then go on to the Olympia from there. Well, it was really good this year. It placed top three. Uh, you know, I know that a lot of fans out there are a little bit disappointed because of the fact that you're setting it out. But I think that I agree with your decision. Obviously, we talk a lot about it. And we did the same thing with Phil for a couple of years. We sat him out. And then he was able to come in with the top three finish his first time. And, yeah. you know, that's basically the goal that we're looking for, is going down there and having a huge impact. And obviously, going into the Arnold with a huge, um, you know, trying to go in for it with a big W. So um, I know this year, while you're getting ready for the Arnold, we ended up using some products that ended up making some big differences in your body, yeah. like the Minoject. Uh, you want to talk a little bit about Amino Jack? Um, it's something that I've been incorporating in during my workouts just because it's fermented BCAAs, but it's not a creatine based. So it doesn't, you know, make a lot of people hold water with creatine. So this kind of gets that, fat, that factor, that variable out of it. You know, it still gives you that anabolic and anti catabolic effect while you're training too. Yeah, well, a lot of people were asking me, what was he drinking the whole time? What was he drinking the whole time? And basically, he had the, the, the beta version of it and that he used for this whole prep, and it just came out. So you'll start seeing this on the shelves everywhere, Amino Jack by Evigen. And uh, the great thing is I got some really good athletes who can beta test things to give me feedback, um, not only on flavor systems, but the efficacy of being you know, the recovery. Um, and we're gonna talk more and more about it. Uh, it works in concert with Cellchem, so it's not a replacement for Cellchem, it's just in concert with it, where Cellchem has the creatine as well as the nitric oxide um, to be able to keep you a little bit fuller. People, some people don't want that fullness because it does create a little bit of water retention with it. They want just more branch chain with glutamine and some of the base, basics. That's what this does, but it also is still fermented. So we're not using any of the human hair that the other people are using or the duck feathers. We're using the fermented base just like we did with EDP, with the leucine and EDP, and the branch chains that are in cell count. So it's still the same fermented quality um, and, and, and amino jet. So a lot of people are still already asking, what's the difference, what's the difference? And we're gonna do more and more videos on this. So definitely you know, follow us on YouTube, follow us on Instagram, and you'll be able to get more and more information and get a chance to win this product for yourself. So again, I'm Connie Rambod, I'm here with Justin Compton. We're here at the NPC headquarters, and we're getting ready to uh, be nine weeks out. And we're gonna do another video, follow-up video with our predictions for the Olympia. I know Justin, I gotta hear what Justin has to say, and we're gonna have some more training tips. So thanks again for tuning in.